Hey, this is Alex with Kickbox Fit, where we bring you kickboxing-oriented workouts every Monday. Today's 30-minute workout is going to be a little bit more upper body focus with the occasional kicks thrown in. So I'm excited, I hope you're excited, and don't forget to like and share. All right, let's get started with that warm-up. We're going to start with knees coming up above our waistline, bringing one knee up and then the other. Main goal here is to get that blood circulating, get that heart rate pumping, pick a one knee and one knee. Holding my hands chest height, bringing that knee to my hands. Breathing, getting that oxygen in. Staying here for a few more, a few more, we're taking a little bit of jog in place. Breathe, I'm gonna get ready for this fun we're gonna have. Taking the jog in place in three, two, one. A little bit of jog in place, shaking off those legs, shaking off those arms. We're gonna be using a lot of it today. We've been doing a lot of punches, few kicks, and nice squats in here. Taking those deep breaths. We're gonna take it into high knee runner now. In five, four, three, two, one. Bring those knees up. Trying to get them once again above that waist. Focusing on picking up that heart rate. We're staying here just for a little bit. And then we're gonna take it down to some squats so we can start warming up those legs. Take those deep breaths. Nice inhale, a nice exhale. Getting ready to take the squats in three, two, and one. Open those legs up, shoulder width or maybe a little bit wider. Keeping that back straight, squatting down. Catch that breath, breathe in, breathe out as you come out. Minute 30 left on the warm up, and then we're gonna get into some stretching. Dropping down, coming up. Five more, four, Three, we're gonna take it into walkouts. Walking our hands out and back into our feet. And three, two, one. Walking those hands out, getting a little stretch. Walking them back in. And up. Back down. Back up. Get a nice little stretch towards our toes as we go down. Walking them out. Walking them back in. Same thing, but now we're gonna go ahead and add a push up. Walking them out with that little stretch. One push up, body or knees, and back up. Five more, down, push up, and back in. Four more, coming down. Get that nice little stretch, feel it in your calves and your hamstrings. Right back up. Two more, walking it out. One push up, back in. And just one more. Walk them out, one push up, walk them back in. Last little jogging place for 15 seconds. Gonna get a quick little stretch and we're gonna get started with this workout. Once again, mainly focus on those arms. Go ahead and pull that arm in, stretch, stretch, stretch. Get that shoulder nice and loose. Switch those sides. Bring that elbow up, pulling behind your head, stretch out that tricep. Switch sides. Only one more stretch after this. Bringing those toes together, reaching down, stretching those hamstrings. Pulling that body in if we can, get as low as we can. And now to finish off, just open up those feet. Drop down a little bit lower. Stretch, stretch, stretch. All right, I think we're ready to get started. All right, 15 seconds, we're gonna start with the first exercise. We're gonna start off with a nice little jab at the front hand and hook, just working the one side of the body. That jab and then that hook. Okay, get it started in five seconds. Getting those hands up, staying nice and loose on the feet, nice and light. Just this hand right here. Ready? That one jab, that one hook. Jab, hook, jab, hook, jab, hook. Now as I'm doing this, I'm using my lower body as long, with my upper body, putting it together. That bottom foot, that front foot is pivoting and turning with my hands. This way I'm not only working that arm, I'm not only working that shoulder, I'm incorporating those legs and that core, just that one hand. I'm gonna stay here for 30 more seconds, picking a pace that suits us. You can stay with me, you can go a little bit slower, or you can go faster. Either one is fine with me, just gonna be your own pace, 
The workouts are one minute long with a 30 sec, with a 20 second break in between. Breathing out on every punch. Exhale in that punch and that hook. That jab and that hook. Exhale just that one side. Breathing out, pushing through, getting ready. All right, shake it off. Either jog in place with me or stay still nice and still catching that breath. In 10 seconds, we're gonna put that other foot back and work the other hand. Working both sides. I like to work both sides to keep everything nice and even. I don't wanna walk around all unproportional. Ready, hands up. That jab, that hook. Jab, hook. Breathing out every time we throw that. Keeping those hands up. Not only is it proper to keep the hands up, this one here, but it's also working this shoulder over here by holding my hands up as much as possible. Watch as that foot turns on that jab and that cross. Breathing out, exhaling, keeping that core tight, keeping that face protected, breathing. Even though this is for a cardio workout, we can still practice some what's form. Exhale, breathe. You got it. Next round, we're gonna start putting everything together with both sides, combining them. Breathing out, exhale. Doing it with you, stay with me, go faster, go slower. That is your choice. We just wanna be here on your fitness journey. Let's go. Push, punch, punch, and run it out. Taking that deep breath. Next round, we're gonna put them together. We're gonna to put your main foot back, your jab, hook, cross, hook. Put it together. That jab, hook on one side, cross, hook with the other. Front and back. Shaking off, getting it ready. As soon as that timer rings, hands up. That jab, hook, that cross, hook. That jab, hook, that cross, hook. Turn that body. Each time I throw that punch, my lower body is moving with it. It's incorporating my core and my legs. Breathing out. Stay with me or go faster. You guys got this. We just want to help you get there. Breathe out, pushing through. Exhale. Keep that core tight. That cross, hook, jab, hook. Breathing, pushing. We want to pick a pace that challenges us, but we can make it through the workout. This is the beginning. We're just starting. After this, we're gonna go into a little bit of squats before we start going back into those hands. That jab, hook, cross, hook. Breathing, pushing through. That hook's coming nice and wide, but I'm not completely dropping it. A jab and cross are coming as straight punches, shaking it off. Good job, 20 seconds. We're gonna drop it into one minute of squats, heating up those legs a little bit more. We started in the warm up. We're gonna continue it now. We got five seconds. Get it ready, get in position. Hands up or out, where you feel comfortable. Foot position where you feel comfortable. Drop it down and squat it. I'm picking a nice casual pace here because now I'm gonna be working my legs quite a bit in this workout. So once again, stay with me. Slow it down if you need to, or pick up that pace. I bring my arms up as I go down. Sitting back to it. My toes are angled out just slightly. And when we do these squats, make sure those knees do not go past that toe. Even though it's a workout, we wanna make sure the form is correct. We do not want any injuries. Just breathe, pushing through. You guys got this. Breathing out, exhaling every time we come up. Breathe in. Breathe out. Staying with me. Staying together. You guys got this. Hands up. Athletes, we're gonna go to a round of uppercuts. Keep that core tight, back straight. Good job. Go ahead, shake those legs off. A little bit of run in place. Like I said, next round, we're going to a round of uppercuts. We're gonna keep our hands up, our main foot back, and we're gonna uppercut and uppercut. The uppercuts are dropping down a little bit low, coming up. Once again, I'm still incorporating those legs in the uppercut. Let's get started. Hands up, load those legs up, uppercut, uppercut. Using the balls of my feet to turn my feet, my legs, my hips, my core, everything coming with that uppercut. We're doing one side 
And next time I'm gonna switch and do the other. That uppercut can stop your chin height or you can go a little bit higher. Imagine if you were against someone a little bit taller than you. You'd have to reach up, but keep that core tight. Use those legs, keeping that other hand up. You guys got this. Breathing out. Exhale, every punch. Coming straight up with those two big knuckles of your hand. One, two, front upper, back upper, non-stop. Go ahead and shake it off. You guys are doing great. Better switch those sides. We got this. Shake that body off. Hands up. Getting to that starter position. Starting with the other side, the other hand. Front hand first. Are we ready? I think we are. Hands up. Uppercut, uppercut. Starting with that front hand. Once again, I'm using those legs to get that punch. I'm not just here swinging my arms up. This is okay. This is gonna work my arms a little bit and my shoulders. But I wanna work everything. I wanna get the most bang for my buck. Uppercut, using those legs, keeping that core tight, adding even a little bit of snap at the end of that punch just to get those biceps involved. Come on, straight up. One, two, one, two, one, two. If you want to involve those legs even a little bit more, you can go ahead and drop it down. That is up to you. This is going to be one of the workouts we're going to do later. Continue. One, two, one, two, one, two. Breathing out. Making that fist nice and tight. When it's about to hit that contact area. Up, front, front. Shake it off. Our next exercise. We're going to a jab cross. One, two, and one kick. Bringing it back. One, two, one kick. Mainly hand focused on this time, but we are going to add a little bit of legs. Putting that foot back, hands up, jab cross, one kick, bring that foot back. Jab cross, one kick, bring it back. Jab cross, kick, back. One, two, three. Breathing out, keeping that body tight. That jab, that cross, it's working that core. It's working those shoulders. That kick is bringing those legs even more into it. Working that hip flexor. We got this. One, two, and three. Stay in here just a little bit more. Fight to not drop those hands. Keeping them up. Keeping those shoulders up. Staying nice and comfortable in the upright position. We got this. Kick, punch, punch, kick. Breathing out. 10 more seconds, and we're gonna switch hands. Working those other jab crosses. That other foot. One, two, three. Chain it together. Trying to minimize the gap between those punches and kicks. Run it out, run it out, or catch that breath. Either way, keep moving, keep the heart rate up. Trying to, whatever you do, do not sit down. Stay up, keep those feet moving. Getting ready to put that other foot back. Working the other side. Get those hands up. Let's do it. One, two, kick, jab, cross, kick. Putting it together. One, two, three. After I finish that cross, before that hand makes all the way back to my face, that knee of my front kicks are already coming up. Putting it together. I'm trying not to pause it. I'm trying not to. Well, I'm trying my best just to get the best workout. work out. If I'm here, I'm not doing too much for my body. I want to incorporate everything, every move. That core should be tight. Minimizing those breaks. Stay with me. Breathe out. We got this. To the end. I believe in you guys. We can do this. Breathe out. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Every time we throw that punch, every time we throw that kick, we're exhaling that breath. Exhale, exhale, exhale. Keep that core tight. Shake it off. Our next exercise. Once again, we do the same thing both sides. We're gonna throw two hooks. One on one hand, one with the other hand, and a squat in between. Hook, hook, squat. Are we ready? Hook, hook, 
and a squat. Let's go. Hook, hook, and drop down. Two hooks, drop down. Two hooks, drop down. Two hooks, drop down. I'm even adding a little hop as I come out of that squat. You can do the same, or you can just squat down and come up. But when we do it, when we throw those hooks, turn that body. I want you to get the most out of your workout possible. Two hooks and drop down. Two hooks and drop down. Hook, hook, drop down. Hook, hook, drop. Exhale, breathing out. Keep that back straight as we squat down. We got this. Turn that body. Keep that head straight. One, two, and a squat. One, two, and a squat. One, two, and a squat. Keep it moving. Keep it going. Keep breathing. You got this. Stay with me. Shake it off, shake it off. 20 seconds and get to the other side. Whew. Run in place. Shake those arms off. Shake those legs off. Whatever you need to get yourself ready for the next round. Whew. Getting ready to switch those feet. Five seconds. Get it set. Hands up. Two hooks start the front hand. And a squat. Hook, hook, and a squat. Hook, hook, and a squat. Whew. One, two, and a squat. One, two, and a squat. One, two, and a squat. You can slow it down and practice that form. And when you're ready, when you feel comfortable, turn up a little bit faster and a little bit faster and start throwing a little bit harder. We got this, pushing through, picking a pace, picking something that challenges us. We get a 20 second rest in between so we can push through. I know you guys can. One, two. And a squat. One, two, and a squat. Hop up if you're ready. One, two, and a squat. Hop. One, two, and a squat. Hop. Breathe it out. One, two, squat down. Let's go. Push through. I'm here with you. It burns a little, but it's good for you. It'll make you stronger. It'll make you feel good. And that's what I'm here for. Shake it off. Legs might be heated up a little bit. Run in place, run in place. Next exercise, we're taking it back into those walkout push-ups. But as we come back up, we're gonna jump those feet out and in. We come down, as this is before. Drop it out, one push-up, drop it in. Let's get started. Hands down, out, one push-up, and in. Stand up, push those hips forward. Down, out, up, and back in. Down, out, up, and back in, breathing, exhaling. We come out that push up and we stand back up. Breathing in, catching that breath as we go down, exhaling as we come up. You can stay here or for the last 25 seconds, you can bring it up and add a nice little hop with those knees, taking it into a full burpee. If you're not ready, stay here. Modification can even walk it out. One, two, and out. But let's keep working all the way to the end. And then we're gonna start some punching combinations. Whew. Whew. Shake it off, shake it off. Next combo, we're going up and down. Jab, jab, cut up across. Jab high, jab low, throw in that cross. Jab high, jab low, throw in that cross. Jab high, jab low, and cross. Let's go. One, two, three, reset. One, two, three, reset. High, keeping that body nice and high as we go down for that other jab and that cross. One, two, three. One, two, three. Keeping those legs in it. One, two, three. Jab high, jab low, cross. Move those feet. Jab high, jab low, cross. If you need to rest in between, keep those hands up and move those feet. Don't stop moving. One, two, three. One, two, three. On that cross, I turn. That back foot. One, two, three. One, two, three. High, low, high. Up, down, up. Keeping those hands up. Come on, you guys got this. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Exhale. All the way through. 10 seconds to go. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. 
One, two, three. One, two, three. And shake it off, run it out. Good job, guys. Let's keep going. Let's keep breathing. Get it ready for the other side. I'm sweating with you, I'm breathing with you. If I got this, you got it, okay? And if you feel like it's hard, you're gonna get there. You have to try and try. One day you will be there if you're not there yet. I believe in you. Hands up, high, low, high. One, two, three. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. On that cross, turn that hip, turn that foot. Get that core and legs involved. One, two, three. Breathe it out. One, two, three. One, two, three. Stay with me. Go faster. Catch your breath. Whatever you need. You got it. One, two, three. One, two. Starting that punch from the ground. One, two. From down here. One, two, three. Breathe it out. One, two, three. Keep those hands up. We got it. Go, go, go. All the way to the end. Breathe it. Push it through. Getting those legs involved. Keeping that core tight. That back straight as possible. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Come on. Hands up. Shake it off, shake it off. Next exercise. We're throwing our front uppercut. Our back hook and our back knee. That knee is initiating the foot switch. So the front uppercut, that back hook, that back knee. Switching our feet, reset them back up. Upper, hook, knee. Slide them back. Upper, hook, knee. Slide them back. Upper, hook, knee. Changing those feet every time. That straight uppercut, that hook, that knee. That knee's bringing me forward. So I need to slide back to reset myself. That upper, that hook, that knee. Now when I throw that knee, I'm pointing my toe and pointing that knee out. Upper, hook, knee. Picking a pace that we feel good with. Upper, hook, knee. Upper, hook, knee. Kind of leaning my body back just a little bit as I throw that knee. Keep going. Don't wait for me. Push. Breathe. That upper, that hook, that knee. That upper, that hook, that knee. Pick a something that challenges you. Moving back and forth. Shake it off, shake it off. Good job, guys. Next combo. We're going to two front kicks, that front leg, that back leg, and squat upper cross. Squat down, upper, squat down, upper. Starting with our foot, that front foot, that back foot. Squat upper, squat upper. Let's get started. Front, back, bring them back. Squat upper, squat upper. Incorporating, shaking as we need. One, two, drop it down for one, two. Warm up those legs as we go down. One, two, drop it down. One, two, stay with me or go faster. You got it. Picking the pace you need. One, two, drop it down. One, two, reset. One, two, drop it down. One, two, breathe out. We got this. Breathe. One, two, one, two, kicks. Down, two, uppercuts, two, kicks, we got it. Down, two, uppercuts, keep that core tight. Keep those hands up, all the way through. One, two kicks, drop it down, breathe, breathe. Good job, same thing, other side. 60 more seconds, we're gonna switch those feet. Like I said, I like to keep it even. You guys got it. Shake it off, catch your breath. Jog in place if you can. Push it all the way through to the end. Five seconds, hands up. Two kicks, one, two, two uppercuts. Let's go. Tick, kick, bring it down. Upper, upper, reset. One, two, bring it down. One, two, those kicks don't have to be super high. We can keep them. Waist height, but I wanna try your best not to let them down here. We're not going for those shin kicks and we're not going for those floppy arm punches. Keep it up, keep that knee up. That foot, at least waist height. Squatting, initiating the uppercut from the bottom of the floor. Kick, kick, drop, upper, upper. Reset, kick, kick, drop it down. Upper, upper. You guys got it. By starting that upper from down here, I'm gonna incorporate 
those legs even more than if I did it separately. If I came squat, two uppercuts, not the same thing. Those two kicks. Drop it down, upper, upper. Breathe, one, two. Drop it down, upper, and upper. Good job, guys. We're getting closer and closer to the end here. Keeping those hands up, breathing. Next, we're just gonna do a little exercise, a little less cardio, but I'm gonna pivot my foot and reach out. Pivoting and reaching. Practicing that movement, extending this core. Reaching out, all the way. Try to make that heel point towards the opposite wall as you reach forward and extend. It's gonna work that stomach. You should feel it up here in your core. Reaching as far as you can. If we're doing this, if we're not fully extending, we're not gonna feel it. We have to turn that foot all the way out, as far as you can. Over, turn that core. Practicing that hip motion. Picking that heel up. Sticking those fingers out straight. Face height, over, over reach. You're trying to pick up something that's too far away. You have to reach super far. Get it, 15 seconds here. We got it. Let's go. Let's breathe. Let's exhale. A little less on your cardio. After this, I'm gonna do a little bit more core on the ground. Reach all the way on the other hand back to your face. After this, we'll drop down to two sets of core. First, I'm being in crunch position. My knees are gonna be open and I'm gonna reach down the center of my knees. So I'm laying down. Knees are open, I'm gonna crunch up. Reach my fingers down the center. Are you ready? Let's get started. Reaching down and coming up, crunching. Feeling it right up here. Making sure to get those shoulder blades off the floor. We don't wanna just come here. You wanna get up as much as possible, but we're not doing a full sit up. Just that crunch motion, those shoulder blades up. My mid back is coming up just a little bit, but my lower back is still maintaining constant contact with the floor. We're only here for a minute. Next exercise, I'm in the same position, but we're gonna reach on the outside of those knees. We got it, sit up and reach. Sit up and reach, keep my head off the floor the entire time. Let's go. Breathe out, push through. 20 second rest coming up. You got this. Come on, your own pace, stay with me or not, but you can got it, do not stop. Don't quit, keep going. And sit up and relax. Awesome job guys. Stay here, relax, catch that breath. We're gonna come down and exercise, same motion, but now we're keeping those knees together and we're reaching those fingertips across the outside of our leg. Same thing, one minute here. You guys got it. Getting started in one second. Let's get ready. Coming down, sit up, reach up. Right along the outside. After this, we're getting back to our feet. Take a break when you need. But I believe that 20 seconds with one minute rounds is more than enough to recover. Pushing through, exhaling. Breathe out as you come up, breathe. Exhale, get that back, oh, that upper back off the floor. Keep constant contact with that lower back. We don't want to arch it. We don't want this coming off. We want this to stay down here. Reach up, reach, breathe out. As you come up, exhale that breath. You got it. All the way through. I'm in pain with you. Fight through until the end. You got it. It's only a minute and it's about to come to an end. Let's go, breathe. Breathe. Whew. Back up to your feet. Shake it off, shake it off. Bring those hands up, reach those hands back. Ready for one more combination. And then we're gonna go to some single punches. Next combo, we're coming down for two punches to the body. One, two, coming up for two hooks. Ready, hands up. Get that good foot ready. Coming down, one, two. Coming up, hook, hook. Back down, one, two, hook, hook. Put it together, one, two, hook, hook. As soon as this right hand finishes, we're coming up for that hook and follow the other one. Down, down, up, up. Breathing out, down, down, up, up. Exhaling, one, two, three, four, 
Forehead combo. One, two, three, four. We got this. One, two, three, four. Two down. Two up. Two down. Two up. Keep that core tight. When you go down, don't bend that head. Don't bend that back. Keep it nice and straight. One, two, three, four. Hands up. One, two, three, four. Dropping down. One, two, three, four. You guys got it. One, two. Turning that body with those hooks. One, two. Breathing out. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four. Ah, breathe. Run in place. Getting ready to switch those feet. Work on the other side. Shake up what you need. Whatever you need to get ready for that next round. Hands are up. We're ready. Dropping down those two hooks. One, two, three, four. Let's go. One, two. I messed up. One, two, three, four. Back down. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Breathing. Come on. It's all in your head. Zone it out. Calm that mind. Once you relax and throw those punches, you can find that you keep on going. The more you tense up, the more you tighten up, the harder it's gonna be. Relax. Go through those correct motions. You got it. One, two, three, four. Come on. One, two, three, four. Stay with me. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four. We got it. One, two, three, four. Hands up. Bounce if you need that rest. Whatever you do, don't let those hands drop. One, two, three, four. Pass me. One, two, three, four. Pick it up. You can go faster than me. You can pass me. You got this. Go. 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 All the way to the end. And shake it off. Good job, guys. Good job. All right. Going into that cool down. Good job today, guys. Good job. Finishing the same way we started. Pull the arm in. Releasing that tension in the shoulder. Exhale. Take those deep breaths. You guys did an awesome job. You stayed with it. You finished through if you made it this far. Switch. And if you didn't, you can. It's in your head. Breathe. Stay with me. If you get tired, you have to slow down. Keep to your pace. But you can easily finish 30 minutes. Bring the elbow up. Pulling that elbow and stretching. You guys got this. Breathe. Exhale. Switching that side, pulling that other elbow. Good job, guys. Good job. I'm gonna finish with one stretch down to our toes and then opening up those feet. Same way we started, feet together, stretching down. Reaching down to those toes, that floor. As you relax and breathe out, you can go lower. Relax is the key. And open up those feet to that last stretch. You guys did an awesome job today. I can't wait till next Monday <clears throat> when you guys have to take my workout or Christina's workout again. But we'll be posting every Monday. And as you guys follow us on our journey, you'll get fitter, you'll get stronger, you'll feel better. Until next week, I'll see you.